Hey guys, and welcome back to for a village, uh, Shadows of Rose. Let's continue, shall we? So we've got the la all of the masks. That's kind of a gribbly statue too. Ugh. Anyway, kind of cool as well. Love to have artwork like that. One day when I'm a billionaire, maybe. Um. Ah, did we not put the? Ah, look at that. We didn't even bother putting the bronze mask on. There we go. Now, the prize is ours. We can finally get out of this hellscape. In a manner of speaking. I need more coffee. <laughs> well done, little one. You've more than earned this reward. Almost looks like the real thing, doesn't it? What? <laughs> it's a replica, of course. Nothing that valuable could ever manifest on this stratum. <laughs> Did you really think I'd give away something so precious? I had to bait the trap with something. No! 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 <laughs> Well, that's not very nice, is it? What a burk. What an absolute burk. <coughs> now comes the real fun. The perfect place for your demise. <laughs> Let the show begin! Yeah, so, uh, you didn't really think it was going to be that easy, did you? Ugh. I genuinely, when I was playing this, because I hadn't read anything about this game, at this DLC, I didn't want any spoilers. Uh, I genuinely thought that would be the end. We do. Now, I don't know how hard this dickwad's going to be. On this difficulty. Even uglier now. Yeah, he's kind of uglier, but he's he's cute in a lot of ways as well, so um there's some more shotgun shells. Very nice. Right dude, if you could be so kind just stand still for a minute. Must I shoot at your face? Your definitely not pretty face. Uh that's not exactly my inventory, is it? So, I'm going to keep using our power on this guy. That's <laughs> yeah, I'd say so. I'm entertained. Alright, well, he seems to be getting his jog on. Which is... Oh, hi! Um, Rose, that's it. I thought you'd be more of a fighter. Oh, so it's very difficult using that. Um, power because it does take a little bit to actually activate. Uh, do we want to use a herb? I think we'd be all right, actually. To be honest, I think our health is just going to come back naturally. I mean, he is kind of getting a wiggle on. That's right. If we keep tightly... Oh, hello. Mold powers. Mold. Oh, I wonder if that's going to be a better way of doing it, actually. Yeah, all right, Rose. Calm down. I mean, that's doing the damage. Oh, he's coming. He's coming. He's an angry old bastard when he gets going, isn't he? I do love to watch you rabbits. Well, I mean, we're not struggling too much. Not yet. Can we? 
Yeah, that's what I mean. It seems to take so long for that to that mold power. I think that's a bit of a difference between the difficulties. Because it activates really fast on normal, whereas this, you, you kind of have to aim it at him for a good few seconds. Oh! <laughs> Tries to get a little bit tricky, doesn't he? That's cute. Keep dancing, boy. Keep dancing. That's right. Oh, we've still got some fight, don't worry. We've got a lot of fight left yet. So after he's tried to grab us a couple of times, and our health comes back, ooh, he does kind of get a little bit antsy, doesn't he? Right, so we want to wait for him to attack, and then hit him. There we go. Uh, is he dead? Mm, doubtful. Well, look at you! So much feistier than those other little rats. Yeah, well, you know. This is becoming genius. Time to shake things up! Yeah, can we not? Can, can, maybe, can we not? Can we not shake things up that much? Uh... I'd rather not. No. Oh, hello. And we have no um, powers. That's awkward. So we're going to have to use some health here. That's okay. Seriously? Look, I literally just got out of one bit of danger into the next. I mean, honestly, you guys have fuck all respect for anybody. And I don't like that, I'm going to be honest. I'm a little bit put off by that. Why does that keep coming up when I go to go into my inventory? Maybe we will never know. Um, so what's in the old bag? Ah. Yes, we could do. We can make so many healing potions, it's kind of crazy. Oh, there we go. Right, now that opens up the loop the loop. Hey, dude. You can piss off. Kind of don't really want to have to play with you. If I can help it. Now. Problem is, obviously the shotgun... Ain't too great at range. There we go. Oh! I'm not convinced that really helps us out, to be honest. No, we don't examine it. Use. There we go. Run! Run! Must run faster! Must run faster! Wow, he's really using all of our health there. Damn it! Uh, I didn't really want to use that, but we really need to slow him down. Last shotgun shell. Look, dude. Are you gonna be angry all day, or there we go? Oh shit! Is me trying to? There we go. Is me trying to blast away at him. And uh, the fella's already had enough. Yeah, man. Show yourself. This is the most insipid fight I've ever seen. Well, uh, good. I guess. Damn it, these assholes are back. And we can't make anything good. Alright, well, it is what it is. No goodies here either. You call this a show? Well, I'm waiting for your pet to come along. Sorry, friend. I can't be expected to do all the legwork. Can I? Honestly, you call yourself a host. Wait a minute. 
Where is he? Oh, there he is. Don't let her get away with there we that. go. Alright, well, I mean, I'm back to not really calling the shots, if I'm honest. Ooh. Take this. Yes, please. Uh, upgrade for our mold powers. Don't mind if I do. Excellent. Ah, that's better. Looping around again. So now we can hold an extra bit of power. Oh, you're going to be a dickhead, aren't you? Obviously you are. Oh, he's got a bit of a wiggle on. Although, I think... Funny enough, he just helped us in a rather unfortunate way. Right, okay. Fine, that worked. Yep, you're just gonna get in the way. In a very annoying fashion. That will do. Possibly need to get rid of you. And possibly you too. Oh, hi. Oh, I thought we were dead then. Really need to kill you. Because we've got one charge of this left. And that's that. Come on literally all we have I mean he's with the not looking so this. good to be honest ah here he comes and we don't have any oh no don't call oh god hello uh, this is bad this is not great. Oh dear. Nope. Don't like this. Not a fan. Gonna be honest. Okay. Made it. Now what we could really use would be a sprig of the good stuff. Yes, and he's not gonna let us have one. What are you doing, sir? You're like turning up and then you're disappearing. Oh, that was a cheap shot, dude. Very cheap shot. I mean, I knew this guy was going to be spicy, but dude. This ain't spice, this is salt. So, what happens if we don't have enough ammo to defeat this guy? Because... There's another certain bit like this later on and there's kind of unlimited ammo in a way oh there we go that came close Useless creature. very Such close <sighs> no matter your imminent demise is inevitable So even with all that saving, we only just had equipment to get through that. Okay. So out of one hell into another. Where am I now? Str 
at him. Deeper you go, harder to escape. I don't want to leave. Not until I find that crystal. I'm tired of being a freak. I want to have friends. I want to live a normal life. Without this... curse. If that purifying crystal can make that happen, make me normal, then I'm not going back until I find it. Yeah, so? All right, then. Okay. So, yeah, I genuinely, when I was playing this, um, there's no going back now. I thought that was the end of this DLC, but no, it carries on. In fact, we're not really that close to, well, I don't know, we, we are a good chunk. That beginning bit seems to be the longest. This DLC is basically three sections. That was the first one. This is like the middle of the game that I was uh, talking about in the beginning of this. I don't like this. I really don't like this bit. I know where the crystal is. Hmm. Intriguing. I mean, there is one cool thing about this that I will get into as and when it happens. Ooh. But, as it stands, not a fan. Will you be my friend? No. Fuck off. I guess we don't have a choice. Give me the crystal. Give me the damn crystal. And again, I will say, this game, oh, it's pretty. It's very pretty. I swear I've seen these monkeys before, but what the hell? Let's play. Let's play a game. So, if you're familiar with the um, main campaign, you'll know where we're going. I don't know if there's actually anything out here to grab. I'm guessing we can't go back now anyway. Oh, we can. Okay. Okay. Cool. Um, I don't see any obvious grab points. But then, actually, I, I guess... I guess there probably wouldn't be anything out here to grab, to be honest, because... Well, we'll soon see. Let's go down. Or up. What's wrong? Okay. What? Something seems different. Something's definitely a little bit different, I can tell you that. Welcome, Rose. Okay, this is weird. Oh, yes it is. This is weird. Now, much like the original game, uh, there's no combat in this section. Um, and unfortunately, yeah, it's got some interesting ideas, but. So, January 5th. Today was my first day of school. I've always wanted to go. I'm going to give Chris a big hug next time I see him. There were so many kids my age, it was like I walked into a TV show or something. I was so scared when I had to introduce myself to the class. But I was still super duper excited to be there. I'm going to make so many friends. I'm going to try and talk to them tomorrow. The diaries in this section are pretty good. I will say that. January 8th. I tried to be brave and talk to some other kids. But nobody wanted to talk to me. Schoolwork is super easy. It's all stuff I learned with mummy. But I guess I shouldn't answer all of the teacher's questions. The boy behind me said something really mean. My hands go icky with white sweat when I panic. 
It was really bad today. Today the teacher yelled at me for always carrying my hanky. She says I'm not a baby anymore. The boys at school keep saying I'm icky, but I take a bath every night. I always wear clean clothes and I bring a fresh hanky every day. It's because of the stupid white sweat. Whenever it starts coming out of my hands, I wipe it off right away. But sometimes it won't wipe off. I just hold my hanky really tight. Chris even told the teacher I can't get anyone sick. But it didn't change anything. April 4th. Someone finally talked to me. Lucy from my class said she always wanted to be friends. We're going to have lunch together tomorrow. I can't believe it. I'm so happy. I hope Lucy's friend Catherine will be my friend too. This is... Okay, so we're finding out a little bit of character development about Rose's time at school. Now, um, this is, this is quite interesting. Actually, I have no idea why Rose is going to like a normal school. I have no idea. Don't get it. But, hey, whatever. It's, it's Resident Evil, I suppose. But it just doesn't make sense. She's obviously like a biohazardous weapon do. Why is there a picture of me? <clears throat> Even if she is a good one. You know, it's, yeah, it's weird. Huh? <laughs> Well, this is different. Well, okay. Looks like our prize is looking right at us. But it can't be that easy, right? Crystal's right here, but there's no way I can get it. Yeah. My stuff. Take all of our guns and stuff away from us. I don't know. Right, even take all of our health items and stuff away. Ah, I didn't realize that. Okay. So this follows very closely. His stomach has been stitched up. This follows extremely closely to the main game. Mr. Monkey has a tummy ache. He might give you the crystal if you help him. Okay, well, let's go slice into Mr. Monkey's stomach, shall we? Seems like a reasonable thing to do. So, ooh. Turn that water off. So she literally is dripping um, sweat uh, when she gets a bit of anxiety. But it's the uh, my seed. Like, sweat. So... It's probably not good for her to be just mingling around with other people, but... I mean, what do I know, I suppose? Something's making a load of noise. Oh. Hello. Scissors to cut open the stomach. The stuffed locker. The picture on the bookshelf. The desk covered in stuff. Okay. So, the stuffed locker... This one, perhaps? O2. Oh. Somebody trying to come in. I mean, honestly. Bastard. Could have just asked or let you in. Um, and then we have 44. So we've got O2, 44. Calm down, Rose, in 66. You'll be fine. Uh, I th think it's... What what way is it? It's stuffed locker, picture on the bookshelf. Right, okay, so it's O2 44 66. Okay. So we've got O2 44. Sixty-six. Hey, and then we got some scissors. Very nice. So now let's go perform surgery. Well, something's happening outside. 
All right, well, we're not going to worry about that too much. Oh. What the hell? Hello. I guess they would just want to give us a hand. <laughs> a hand. <laughs> uh. Oh. He literally just offered us a hand. Can't say fairer than that. An arm as well. Right, so let's get your operation going, Mr. Monkey. Old rusty scissors. They should still work. Okay. Oh. A relief of a child. Whatever. Whatever, kid. Uh, you know how to play with dolls, don't you? Uh, kind of. Think. Ken, what now? Well, that's awkward. Play with the dolls. So, we have Lucy. I bet you can find all kinds of places to play with this doll and her friends. Maybe you'll get the crystal once you get the campfire started. Hmm. Okay. And who is that on the campfire? No, 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 no. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. Okay, then. Now, I think to actually save the game. Can we even save Someone the game, actually? Really went all out. Yeah, they really kind of did, to be honest. I mean, I would feel flattered, but, you know. Oh, so we can, I guess, go back here and save the game. Yeah, we're on 27 minutes. Bit early, but we need a fresh amount of time, so. Drop a save. And when we come back, I guess we're going to go through that door that needs the baby relief thing. So, thanks for watching, guys. And as always... The next time.